Hi, I'm Richard Byrne. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create your own virtual reality tours by using Expeditions Pro. I previously made a video about how to go on virtual tours with Expeditions Pro. That video is linked up down below, but this is how to make your own virtual reality tour. So we're at expeditionspro.com and we're going to scroll down till we see the create your own virtual tours option and click on get started. I've already done that and you can see here's my account where I have some tours already made. Now let's go ahead and make a new one and this new one that I'm going to be going to be making is all about my favorite local ski areas. So I'm going to put in the title of ski areas and we'll just write a short description, a few cool places, get it, cool places to ski in Maine. And let's fill in that category. And you can see here, we have a whole bunch of different options we can pick from. Right, we can say places and scenes. Let's put, that, put this one in sports and fitness. And let's select a cover image for this tour. So in this case here, I'm going to grab this picture of myself and my toddler learning to ski, and I'll use that as my cover image. Now, obviously it's got a little, been a little distorted, so I might want to pick a different one if I was going to actually publish this tour, but for now, we'll just leave that one in there. Now let's go ahead and create this tour. So we're going to, again, say it's sports and fitness, and we're going to save it, and my tour has been updated successfully. You can see that right below my head here in the video. Now we're going to add our first scene to the tour. So let's add that scene. And in this case here, we're going to now upload an image. Now you have to use 360 degree imagery or 180 degree imagery. And fortunately, if you have an Android phone or an iOS phone, the cameras built in have that kind of capability now. And in my case here, I have a 360 degree image that I took way back in January of this year at the top of one of our local ski mountains. And you can see that right there. And I'm just going to download that. And again, I have that saved in my Google Photos. My Android phone backed up to my Google Photos with that 360 degree imagery. And so I'm going to just select that. And I just put that in my downloads folder. Let's put it right there. And now we have it in place. Let's click done. And we can see uploading new scene is happening in the background here. So just click done and now it's loading. And we can see here, there's my 360 degree imagery. We can pan down and see the ski tracks that are right below us. And we can spin and zoom and you can even see right below and right above where I was holding my phone when I took this image. Now, I'm gonna set my starting view. And so this is my starting view. We're looking over here, that's Mount Washington in the, in the distance. And we're going to now give this a name. So let's move this over here and let's give this a name. And we'll call this one Mount Washington from Mount Abram. And we'll put in our information about the location and say, this is a view of Mount Washington as seen from the top of Mount Abram. Now you can write more in there if you want to. And you'll notice we also have here the option to add background audio or ambient audio or the option to add scene narration. So I'm gonna add my scene narration 
And to do this, I need to upload an audio file, an MP3 file. And I'm going to show you my favorite tool for making a very short MP3 file, and that's Vocaroo. So I'm going to go to vocaroo.com. And I'm just going to record my narration that I'm going to upload eventually to my Expeditions Pro Tour. This is a view of Mount Washington as seen from the top of Mount Abram, where I'm standing in this picture is referred to as the snow fields on Mount Abram. And it's what you would call the backside of the ski resort. And so let's save this. We'll download it as an MP3 file. You can see it's downloading right there on my computer. And now let's select that audio file that I've now saved on my computer. And let's here's here's a view, view of Mount, Mount Washington. Washington. And we can hear it played back. And let's add this in. Now we can also add a point of interest inside this scene. Now a point of interest could be useful for showing a little bit more detail of something here in the scene. For example, if I want to point out these solar panels that are over here, let's add a point of interest and let's call this one solar panels. And we'll describe this and say that Mount Abram has been a leader in adoption of solar energy for powering the resort. And so we can fill that in. Now we can also add an image overlay here, or again, add more scene narration by using that same process that I just demoed of using Vokuru and then uploading my MP3 file. But for this case here, let's just leave it as is. And let's make sure we have, you can see here, I forgot to save my scene before adding my hotspot. So let's rename it, call it Mount Washington as seen from Mount Abram. And there's my hotspot and my scene now all created. Now to add more scenes, just repeat that same process over and over again. You'll see that all of your tours appear under my tours. And you can see there it is my ski areas tour with one scene in it right now, but I could continue to go back in and add more to that tour. Once you've completed your tour, you can view it on your phone. You can share it with your students or if your students are making tours, they can share them with you. And my video about how to view tours is linked up right down below. As always, for more things like this, please check out freetechforteachers.com or subscribe to my YouTube channel.